Hello everyone, how are you doing? Hope um hope you're doing well. Hope all your investments are doing well. Hope the family is doing well. Uh in today's video, we are going to look over the portfolio. It's been a minute since I did one of this, maybe over two weeks now. Uh, I've just been busy with trading content. But yeah, in today's video, we are going to look at the dividend investing portfolio. We have gone up pretty much, you know, we've earned $191 dollars almost at two hundred dollars and once we get to two hundred dollars i'm gonna celebrate uh two hundred dollars in passive income this is quite amazing to me i never thought i could build a portfolio where i'm earning money passively without having to do anything you know so i'm excited about i'm excited about that definitely very very excited about it take a look here we we'll look at um we look at our, our performance just by looking at just the numbers for one day uh we're, we're down today for the week for the week we're up nine hundred dollars nine twenty two for the week we earned seven dollars seven dollars and um fifty seven cents for the week and for the month this is my biggest month yet because i've been tracking this data and i'm going to show you show you uh show you what i've been doing doing and how i've been tracking the data uh but this is my biggest month yet today i earned 65 dollars in pure passive income pure purely passive income i did not have to do anything for me to earn this money it was just pure passive income this is quite nice that I'm earned that I've earned sixty sixty five dollars for the month here. If you look at the past um three months, the past three months the portfolio have generated a hundred a hundred and thirty five a hundred and thirty five dollars here. We generated generated a hundred and thirty five dollars. Really happy about that. The portfolio has performed well. If I look at the overall here, the portfolio has performed well. We're still up 17%. Um, if I click on all time, which is will be May, May, May 19th to October 30th, uh, October 13th. I'm sorry. So we are up 17%. We've actually earned cash money that we've earned so far this year, $191. And the gain, the market gain has been three three thousand dollars so that has been tremendous that's been huge 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 gains this year i mean so far this year and here are some of my uh some of my current um sector holdings i will call them sector holdings because these are all different sectors and they all geared towards doing different things those of you that are interested in um looking at the portfolio if you want to take a look at my portfolio click in the link below and look at this uh, click on this link you can click on this link it will show you how my portfolio has performed and all the stock that is in the portfolio you can actually check it out by clicking on this link this is updated every single time I post a video and for those that are interested in joining M1 and doing uh, um, you know investing uh, doing something doing something like I'm doing you can click on this link this is the join um, this is the referral link by using this referral you'll be supporting my channel I appreciate you and uh, let's get back into the video so the other piece of information that I'm quite excited with, to share with everybody is that I track this information I, I track my dividend payment on a monthly basis and in January the portfolio earned um one dollar one dollar one dollar fifty in february we earned three dollars almost four dollars here we earned seven march we earned seven seven in april we earned eight in um may we earned four four dollars in uh june thirty three dollars july twenty seven august twenty basically almost 30 bucks uh, 29 and in September here we are at 60 we had 66 dollars so the, the the growth in in the dividend has actually been quite nice it's been compounding nicely so I'm looking forward to sharing sharing this growth with you in the future 
So if we do some some rough estimate here, this is what the income trajectory is looking like um, so far. By April twenty, uh, by April next year, I should be projecting to be to I should I should be making eight hundred. I should I should make eight hundred dollars in dividend in passive income. So I'm looking forward to that. Um, I'm looking at ways that I can, you know, really uh, take all the data from the portfolio and presenting it to you in a different way so you can visually see it. Uh, but yeah, so so far the progression on the portfolio, the, to, the trajectory of income uh, from the portfolio is looking really, really nice. So this is also another different view, uh, another different way of looking at a portfolio, portfolio here. Uh, as you can see, we've broken right over $60. $60. And uh, on a monthly basis, the, the, the dividend has been increasing slowly. And this is how compounding interest work, right? Because the money that I get in dividend, I put it right back into the into the portfolio so you can earn more, more money. So that's exactly what I'm doing, doing with the portfolio here. And it's been doing quite amazing. So I'll be looking forward to sharing more data with you guys um, in the future. The activity here, I always like to share this, share this with you guys because I want to be as transparent as possible with this dividend investing investing here. Looking at looking at the activities, you see the money don't come in. I don't earn big bucks like that. It comes in little by little. But I want to show you guys that small money adds up to big bucks over time. And as you can see here, we have 40 cents, 11 cents, 21 cents, and they just come in little by little. This was a dollar, just come in little by little, and they add up. It adds up. It, you know, all the money, all the money that comes in is just very, very little money that comes in. You don't have to have a lot of money to invest. You can start small and just collect all the little money that you know companies, great companies, uh, that that we we all use that stuff. You know, all this company we buy and use this stuff. So I'm looking forward to taking a piece of their profit every single quarter. Um, so yeah, this is how the dividend come. This is how the dividend comes in. So let me show you a little bit of uh, of some trading activities. What I've been doing. I haven't been really putting much money into the market, and we're gonna talk about the market in a bit. I haven't been putting a lot of money into the market, but I have been putting more money into Tesla. Uh, I'm gonna share share that with you in just one second. Here. This, for those of you guys that don't um, follow follow my channel closely, maybe you only watch this video. I started a brand new series where I talk about uh, I'm gonna be putting twenty dollars a day, very very little money. I'm gonna be putting very little money a day into Tesla. I really do believe in the company. I think the company is one of my biggest holdings. I'm gonna show you guys that in a second. Uh, but I've been putting twenty dollars, just little little money um every single day into tesla and i've been dollar cost averaging and i believe that the company uh are going to basically they've won the decade when it comes to the ev industry and i believe that they are just starting their growth curve and the, the company is going to make the company still have a lot of room to grow in terms of um in terms of their hold in terms of their business and also in terms of you know their growth you know the, the growth their growth, growth potential it's actually really high it's quite high so i'm looking forward to that and i've been dollar cost averaging into the company as you see there's a 20 there's a 20 this 20 dollar waiting to buy and it's gonna buy in the morning uh my current holding is like seven shares just over seven shares i'll be at eight soon average price was is two um 250 dollars Right now, the price is at uh, four four forty six. Um, you, you know, those of you guys that you watch this channel on a regular, you know that I'm a big fan of uh, Tesla's work. I believe in their mission, and I believe that this company would really help my portfolio grow a lot over time. Even though this is a dividend dividend um, uh, portfolio, but I believe that by adding Tesla would add a lot of value. Uh, we'll add a lot of value to the portfolio, so that's exactly why I'm adding Tesla to the portfolio. So, highly rec recommend you look into Tesla and see how they're doing. The other company that I'm 
very very bullish on uh lately has been has been apple uh they just renew release uh, a set of a set of new iphones um uh, the iwatch the I ipads they just released a set of brand new products which i believe will help their company grow really really fast closely at the portfolio you can see that the tesla is right up there um i have put in a cost basis so far this uh it, the the um stock has cost me uh nineteen hundred dollars and the current value is uh three thousand four hundred dollars so it's, it's it has actually grown a lot and i'm gonna be dollar cost av dollar cost averaging into the stock um this one right here this is my monthly dividend uh payment payment uh, etf this pays me about 15 dollars a month that's just constant every month and because I, I believe in having a, a couple of stocks that pay you x amount of money pretty much guaranteed every month and i have a couple of that and it's like 20 or 35 dollars guaranteed every month that i'm getting paid as the base baseline and then i have a bunch of different companies that pay at different times maybe after uh they pay every quarter some of them they might pay this uh this month and then they don't they're not going to pay for the next month and then next month a set of new companies will pay as well so that's a that's a really really good um good way of making sure you have sta stable company that are gonna well stable etf that are paying you every month in addition with other companies as well so my third biggest holding is apple um and they just released their product today i'm excited about apple i think i'm going to be putting more money into apple as well maybe i'm going to be putting in uh ten ten dollars or so every day or something like that i'm still thinking about it but apple has been um they, they've been innovating they've been pushing the boundary for a long time and i'm actually quite bullish on them as well this is a monthly dividend paying stock this is a monthly dividend paying stocks and as you can see some of my top holdings here are actually actually like uh etfs uh some of my biggest holdings here the etfs and we get into just regular stocks so i encourage you to, i encourage you to check the link down below and um go look at all these companies that i that i have go check them out and um maybe you can add a few of them to your portfolio as well and into the market here the stock market has been a bit of a roller coaster this year this year has been quite a year so if you look at one year here you can see during the beginning of the year everything was going well then we have we had the rona and the market went down this is where i was buying stocks aggressively and then the market has been pretty much pushing up now once 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 we got to this stage here when we we recently saw this decline in the market which is like a 10 percent decline in the market i stopped adding new money to the to the market because a, a, a lot of things was just too shaky at that point uh we have the election coming up in the u.s we have uh, the coronavirus that we're dealing with, we have the stimulus check that is maybe may, might come, might not come. So there's just a bunch of issues. So right now, the only companies that I'm, the company that I'm buying is Tesla, and I'm not buying um, and I'm not even adding money into the portfolio. I'm just trying to hold on to cash, maybe until after the election. And then once the election is over, and we know who's the president, and we know how the market is going to react. Uh, then we can go from there. But although in general, it's just better to dollar cost average no matter what. But at the moment, I believe uh, because I'm managing, I'm managing my own portfolio here, and I believe that the market still has a long way to go in terms of um, a long way to go in terms of growth. But the market just don't like um, uncertainty, and there's a lot of uncertainty right now. So. I, I, this recovery right here this recovery this was a 10 percent recovery as well so it basically recovered from from all the losses that we had from at, at this point so here to there we're basically down two percent but if you look at year to date let me see if i can get this year to date in without this highlight 
Uh, sorry about that. Yeah, today we are up eight percent on average this year. So we've seen a lot of big swings. Uh, I'll keep an eye on this and keep updating updating you guys on 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 this matter. Overall, overall here, if we just just take a look at the portfolio overall, the portfolio is performing really well. It's holding up very very well. Um, the dividend payment has been coming in consistently, which is what I love about a portfolio like this. Uh, links will be in the descri description for you to go check out. Um, you can check out all my different stocks that I have in here. You see the numbers, you see how, how, how nice they look. Um, during the market downfall, uh, during the market uh, downturn, in May, that's I think that's what I, that's what has helped my portfolio a lot. As you can see, the growth here is is actually been quite nice. So I caught I caught the market at the right time. It's basically luck. I wouldn't say I'm a genius or anything like that. It's just luck. Okay, I, I was at the right place at the right time to put money in the market at the right time. So and that's what I'm planning on doing right now because right now I'm I'm just looking forward to. The election being over, the stimulus check being passed, we know what's going on, and then I can go back into dollar cost averaging into the market because if we are going to see I'm not if we're gonna see a big downturn, um let's say let's say we're gonna see another big downturn from like another big another another big big downturn. Let's say if we get uh something like this, you know, we see like a twenty percent uh downturn. I'm going to be a buyer at that time. I'm going to have enough cash whereby I'm able to aggressively go in and buy stocks if we ever see another, if we ever see a 20% decline. Here, here, I didn't want to buy too much, too much stocks and pull too much money in the market just because it's just a 10% decline. And from the low that I, I was putting money in the market at that time, we've only, we're still up 50, 55%, you know, so that's, that's pretty big. So that's why I'm not putting a lot of money to work right now. I'm just collecting the dividend and I'm buying Tesla. I'm, I'm buying Tesla every single day. Um, so yeah, that's exactly what I'm doing. But the portfolio is doing exactly what I needed to do. Exactly what I needed to do right here, which is to go out and earn money. Earn money and it's doing really really well. So thank you for watching. I appreciate you. Please like and subscribe. Uh, if you're interested in what I do here, there's links down below. You can check out the links down below. I uh, appreciate, appreciate you. Thank you. And I'll see you next time. Um, hopefully when we get to a $200 in dividend payment, I'm looking forward to the first $200 in dividend payment here. We're not too far away. So once that happened, we're going to do a big celebration with me showing my face with this particular series. Um, and then we go back to me, you know, showing my face because I want this series to be just about the portfolio, what I'm doing here. And, uh, just to show you guys what it's like when you just diligently put money into the market and then just let it work for you, in, you know, instead of stressing. So yeah, thank you very much. Please like and subscribe, like and subscribe if, if you like what I do here. Share my channel with other people. I appreciate you. Thank you and have a good one. Bye.